A city alive with the spirit of excitement and a stadium brimming with anticipation. The build-up has been intense and now we just can't wait for it all to begin. It's anyone's guess though, which team will come out on top? All the action coming up next. Don't go anywhere. And hello from one of the newer venues in English football, the Amex Stadium on the South Coast. My name is Derek Ray, and joining me for commentary is Stuart Robson. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Brighton and Hove Albion up against Tottenham Hotspur. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. They're not giving the opposition a look in. That's strong play. Well, sadly, they just couldn't keep possession. And a look at... Hang on, one. Derek, it's a chance here. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. It's a short one. Son. Clears it away. Pat Matar Saar. And Brighton with the ball again. Being pressed and pressed high. Good bit of pressing. Feeding it through. There it is, the opening goal of this match, and what a start they've made. Just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise, and then it's a clinical finish from Son. The outcome was never in doubt. You just knew he would score from there. The match has restarted. 1 0 here. Billy Gilmore. And Spurs moving the ball with purpose. He has time to play it over. What can they do to stop him running at them? Huge block. And deciding to go short with this one. Now sliding in field. Now putting it wide from there. Disappointing. Promising move from Tottenham. Well, didn't go as a plan in the end. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Really nice ball. The crowd encouraging him to take it on. Failure to keep the ball on the part of Dahoud. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. Genuine chance, just can't get it past him. Gilmore. And they continue to advance, and a lot of options here. But really sticking to their task defensively. 
Well, Spurs have dominated the flow of the game in the last 15 minutes or so and have been pressing to extend their lead. They just need to be a bit more clinical in front of goal. Joao Pedro. Kaoru Mitoma. Feltman. Not messing around with that clearance. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Son. Will he play it in? He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Ball retention, so important. A wonderful intervention. Well, they're moving it around with real purpose here. It needs an accurate cross. And denied by the keeper. Impressive. Brilliantly blocked. Well, these fans have had to be patient. Could this be the equaliser? And over it comes. Clearing it away. Well, another corner hot on the heels of the last one. Can someone get on the end of this? Oh, tremendous header that time, but the goalkeeper was there. Not a chance for them again to play it over from the corner flag. Who's going to get on the end of it? And ably dealt with. Adam Webster. Excellent defending. Kulusevsky. Really committed himself to the tackle. And a throw in now. Pisuma. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. Rosenso. It's with Porro. Giovanni Lo Celso. Son. Very effective pass. And that brings to an end the first half here at the Amex Stadium. Well, certainly Hyung Min Son was very hard to contain in the first 45. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. On the pass, a good one. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Well, you can tell what the fans think of that decision. They're certain it should have been a penalty. And played in. 
and the keeper's technical skills there for all to see. Well, from that close in, that's a really good save. Such good reflexes. And a short corner, let's see. Saar. Oh, great play. Son. Can he put it in? And a big moment, a goal for Tottenham Hotspur. And they are going to be difficult to stop now. Well, I think that shows what a good rapport he has with the players. Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. So, 2-0 now. Billy Gilmore. Mitoma. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. That's the kind of shielding play you expect from him. Well, sadly, they just couldn't keep possession. Ferguson. Pedro. Real defensive resilience. Really fine play to keep possession. Plays it back. Superbly read and executed. Could be doing a fine job of protecting the ball. But just like that, possession changes hands. Brennan Johnson. That's useful play. But the danger averted for now. Well, Brighton come away with it. Twenty minutes to go in this one. Gilmore. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Dejan Kulusevski. Eve Bisuma has it. Lo Celso really getting stuck in. And teammates to play it to. Gross still looking to get the shot off. And pure instinct from the keeper. Well, a top-class reaction from a top-class goalkeeper. Brilliant stuff. Can he deliver it with accuracy? And still danger here. Just the clearance that was called for. Just 10 minutes to go. Jan-Paul van Hecke. A good vision there. Could reduce the deficit. Went in strongly to win the ball. So the final whistle almost upon us, and this is not exactly what the home fans had in mind when they arrived at the ground today, Stuart. 
Well, they've been second best, that's for sure. And the main problem has been in midfield, where they've been overrun at times. They just haven't been able to get enough possession. It's not been a good performance today. Romero. A very timely interception. Van Hecke. Mali prevented it from going over the line. Now he must favour the cross. This looks more than decent. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. And the referee has decided to add on three additional minutes. Now the wide area might be the productive area for Spurs. And that's really well read. And there goes the final whistle. I'll tell you what, not the outcome. Fans of Brighton and Hove Albion had in mind this. A defeat. What did you make of it? Well, Derek, they were certainly off the pace today. Beaten to the board in too many key areas. They need to refocus now and perform better next time out. Well, Son, you've got to say, scaling impressive heights and not for the first time. Stewart, he turns on the style yet again. Yeah, he'll be happy coming off the pitch. He worked hard, he was always involved in the game and he scored a very good goal. That was an impressive performance today.